What is going on, everyone? It is the Phantom Michael. I'm bringing you the next episode of our Pokemon Rejuvenation Let's Play. On the last episode, you guys, we made it all the way through that crazy little forest. We found out that Mosley is an orphan, and we finally made it to Akua Town, hopefully trying to fix our snag machine. So we're going to do a quick team recap, and then we're going to go ahead and keep on going. We got ourselves a Ringo the Kecleon with the move Slash Shadow Claw Psybeam and Ancient Power. We have Falcon the Talon Flame with Flame Charge, Roost, Quick Attack, and Peck. We have Eric the Vile Plume, Mega Drain, Growth, Cut, and Acid. We have Hong the Hypno with Hypnosis, Wake Up, Slap, Psybeam, and Synchronize, which is a move I might be getting rid of. Then we have Gator the Fur Alligator with Chip Away, Ice Fang, Water Gun, and Crunch. And then we have Warwolf the Lycan Rock with Rock Throw, Stealth Rock, Rock Tomb, and Roar. So, decent squad. Decent squad. We have the defibrillator. We're trying to revive this old man. He isn't breathing. Alright. I'm going to use the defibrillator. Uh, hello? Why were you knocked out on the floor? You darn whippersnappers never ha have any manners. Don't you know how impolite it is to wake an old man from his nap? Nobody knows the troubles I've seen. Youth today will never get a sense of privacy or courtesy, but we silence the nerve of you, young lady. I am lecturing you right now, young Missy, and I expect you to sit down and listen. Boy, when I was your age, I spoke to my elders with respect. Ever heard of such a thing? Respect? Nope, they haven't. My mom was murdered when I was young, and my dad never spoke to me. Does that answer satisfy you? <laughs> yes, well, forget what I said. Er, who are you two again? We asked you a question first. Why were you knocked out on the floor? Oh, yes, uh, I can't say I remember. Hmm, yes, well, um, yes. Obviously, you aren't really getting anywhere with this, so I'm done talking. Maybe there's a festival on the beach or something. I'll check there out. Hmm, yes, well, um, I'll try and remember, but I can't promise anything. Okay, is there anybody in here? Free stuff. Can I steal anything? Any anything. No free items. This is a joke. Come on. No free item. There's a there's an item somewhere. I just have to get it. Got it. So there are hidden items around here. Just gotta find them. Hello? Anybody home? Nothing in this house. Not even a bedroom. Is there even any Pokemon here? Let's see what kind of Pokemon we have here. Skitty. I hate when I can't escape. Wow, that did a ton of damage. Goodness. Just die. Well, Kecklein had to turn to a rock type to kill you. That's ridiculous. Freaking ridiculous. Freaking ridiculous. Anybody in here? Oh, there's a TV on. Alright, says the Navy. It's a special time of the day. Your daily dose of breaking news. I'm your host. Bolata, let's get started. Things aren't looking good for Golden, for the foreigners of Golden Leaf Town. Apparently, some crook attacked their gym leader, and because of things, have hectic. Trainers beware of entering Golden Leaf Town for the next well century or so. Apparently, those people can't take jokes, nor can they take interviews. We try people. Anyways, it was discovered that there was a secret underground lab underneath Whipsy Tower. Yeah, you know that tower that burned to the ground many years back. The plot is certainly thickening here, folks. Thank you for watching. Alright, pretty much just told us everything that we just did. Gotcha. What the hell is that? Is that an egg? Is that an egg? Seems to be an abandoned egg here. Oh, I have to get rid of somebody for it. Who am I going to get rid of for this egg? Who am I going to get rid of for this egg? Hmm. 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 
you're almost to the appropriate level. Come on. Got a baby egg here. We have a baby egg here. Shiny giraffe rig, boys. We're catching it. We're catching it. We're catching it. On a great ball. We caught it in one one pokeball. One great ball. Yep. We're calling it Melman. Melman. Got ourselves a shiny giraffe rig, bro. That's sweet. Also, I want to check out this egg. Well, the egg, watch. Well, what has from this egg? It's blue, too. That's weird. Super weird. And I have Talonflame, so Talonflame's ability should help this egg hatch faster. Hmm. Go in here first. More TV. Hunting. Looking for rare Pokemon. Well, the station is your station. With Harry Net as your host and Jeff the Cameraman for today's show, Route 4. Let's take a look around Route 3, shall we? How cute. It seems that wild shinks around these parts. Hmm. Wild Shinx. That'd be a nice type to have on a team. A Shinx would be a nice type to have on a team. A BA Luxury would be totally cool. Hmm. Yes, we have. Yes, we have. We've been here. Oh, there's somebody right there. Oh, it's the truck guy. Forget that. Do you want to go anywhere? Uh, no thanks, bud. Another TV. Hmm. Oh, shoot. Shoot. Of course, they want to get on some action. Guess we side beam in Corsola. Come on. Lucky chant in Corsola, huh? Okay. Lucky chanting Corsola. Throwing some rhyme time on me. Got it. Put down the course. Putting down the course. Is this one shiny? I'm catching it. Not shiny. Don't want it then, Corsola. Don't want you then. We should be grinding into level 40, to be honest with you. That's what we should be doing. I beam. Put you down. Put you down. Oh my goodness at all the course look. That's fine. That's fine. It's okay. A okay. Wow, I wish that would have done a lot more. Hmm. Wish that would have done a lot more. That's fine. That's fine. Spike cannon. Ooh. Both buffeted by hail. Got the boost. Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Lucky chanted. You lucky chanted. Oh, you're dead. Okay. Anything on this rock? Oh, bitch, it's right there. Soda poppy. Anything else? Okay. I ain't gonna bother with this last course, so I'll let you live. Can I go underneath here? No. Oh, there's a ditto. Hello? Nothing. Uh, are you serious? Where is everyone? Is it possible for an entire town to just not exist? But if everyone's gone, then why was that old man on the ground like that? Wait, there's one place we haven't checked. They have a daily performance down by the aquarium. Maybe people are there. 
But even when there's a show, this place is usually packed. Well, there's no use in standing around. Let's go check the aquarium. This is going drill management center. Yeah. You damn right, ditto. If you're that ditto that's been causing me all that bullshit, it's on, bro. It's freaking on. Hope I don't kill you in one hit. Will I kill you in one hit? Will I kill you in one hit? I don't know. I don't know. Perfect. You're this for a reason. You ain't sweeping on me, ditto. Have a ditto. Do I have a ditto? Oh, I almost had a ditto. Almost had a ditto. Do I have a ditto? Do I have a ditto? I almost had a ditto. Come on, man. I want a ditto. How about love ball? Damn it. Come on, Ditto, no bullshit. Got it. Hmm. I'm gonna call this thing. I'm gonna call it Play Doh. Nice if it was an imposter ditto. That'd be sweet. Might have to level this egg up off screen. I might do that. Move. Look, you sap sipper, bro. I like it. The imposter limber. With a quick powder. Is that what it's called? Item take quick powder? I didn't check that. How many people have items on them that I just didn't even realize might have items on them? Should probably get rid of that other guy. I don't know what that egg could be. Let's check real quick. Check my bag. Dawn Stone, can no one evolve with that? Clinton Tag, Max Ripple. Ditto. Hmm. Has to be on a ditto. Interesting. Not know that. Oh, it's a gym too. Hmm. Well, the music is playing, right? That's a good sign. I think that means someone has to be here. Hmm. Let's see if we're late to the show or something. I just don't get it. It's empty. Looks like the doors to the actual aquarium are locked as well. I can see another room that's open across the pool. Maybe something's going on over there. Uh, there's there's nowhere else anyone could be. Everyone from Akua Town has just completely disappeared. And what the hell is that beeping noise? It sounds like an SOS. It seems to be coming from this computer. I'm no computer whiz, but I should be able to make something happen. Hmm. Oh, there seems to be a playable audio file on the desktop. Well, there's nothing else we can do but play it. Here it goes. Hello, hello, can you hear me? This is Valeria Kersey, gym leader of Akua Town and the marine biologist here at the Akua Aquarium. We request backup immediately. Do you hear me? This is not a drill. We require backup immediately. What's going on? Val, there's too many of them. They are already took breaks in an atom. I, I can't hold them back any longer. Oh, God, no. Saki, don't worry. What? Where did we all? Where did you all come from? Let's go, let's go! Okay. What did we just listen to? No, there's gotta be more on that file, right? What about this? It's blinking. What? Hello? 
Is this Valerie Kersey of the Akuma Town? No, th this isn't Valerie. Oh, who are you then? I'm Alita, and this is Phantom. We come to the town looking for Valerie, but we couldn't find anyone. Oh, you aren't those guys. Um, uh, those guys? If you aren't the others, then listen to me carefully. Leave that town immediately. It's not safe there. What do you mean? Nothing is making any sense. That's an order. I'm telling you to. Leave? Oh, God. Something's wrong with the power. X in Team X. Backup generator initiated. Low lighting initiated in order to conserve power. That's it. The power's almost gone. Our time here is up. Let's just leave and head back to Sheridan, okay? Ooh. What was that? Someone's knocking. There isn't even any door here. Oh, uh, hello? Is anyone there? Surprise! Let go of me! Phantom, we're leaving right now. What the hell is going on in here? Oh, shit! Phantom, the water! Yo! Holy shit! Oh, you've got to be kidding me. There's so many of them. Too many, in fact. We can't give up. We've defeated them many times before. Let's go. Hey, Phantom. How are you holding up? No, not so good. Yeah, I'm not doing well either. We've defeated at least five, but they just keep coming. No, that's it. We can't defeat all of them. This is it. This is the end. We lost. Hmm, yes. Mm. Oh, I remember. The whole town was abducted by winged demons. My family is probably dead. Now, where did those two go? Hmm, I bet they got bored and went to have a romantic picnic somewhere. Well, good for them. <laughs> that would have been great information, you bastard. Welcome to the Black Steeple Castle. As of today, you'll be taken under the ownership of the Warden. You will do whatever he wishes. These include fixing up the castle and making it lock, look presentable. What the hell is going on here? We can't just abduct people? I don't understand. Why are you doing this? That info is unknown to me as of the moment, but I'm sure they will become apparent sooner or later. So that's it then. You don't even know. You guys are idiots. Take them to their cells. I've had enough of their screaming. Someone needs to explain what's going on here and fast. You can't just keep us here. We're, we've done nothing wrong. You didn't even take away our Pokemon. Are you guys really that brain dead? Sigh. They aren't even listening to me. They won't listen to a baby screaming about their problems. Do you want to repeat that? I'm sure I'll, I'll get it the second time. You heard me loud and clear. They won't listen to a baby scream about nothing. You probably came in here doing the same thing, right? Kicking and screaming. If you hadn't, maybe you would have told you why they didn't take away your Pokemon. Okay, then. Why did they? Because they rendered our Pokeballs useless. We can't use them while we're here on the island. You can try to activate your Pokeballs, but you'll find out that they won't respond. Hmm. So why don't you actually stop whining and acting entitled, okay? You talk really big for someone who's stuck behind bars. Ah, oh, well, you gotta talk to a baby in a special way, otherwise they won't understand you. If you're gonna talk like that, you better talk to my face. What's your name? My name is... <laughs> well, I'm flattered. My name is Sokka. Sokka Blakery. I'm sure you've heard of me. Well, s Wait! Did you say your name was Sokka? I've been looking everywhere for you. Ah, you found me. Do you want a prize? Where's Waldo? Enough with that smart-ass comment, okay? This is important. Oh, important. Now you've quirked my interest. You there, girl. Your name is Alita, correct? Yes, that's my name. Where did you reside before Black Seven Castle? How about you open the cell and ask me to my face? Maybe you'll get an answer. You're going to... You're doing it again. Stop being an idiot and answer the questions. I didn't ask for your input, Miss Blakery. Whatever, yo. I was just looking out for the squad, yeah? I live in Sheraton Village. I've lived there my entire life. Sheraton Village, ma'am. We're going to need you to come with us. Oh, well, where are we going exactly? We're taking you to the ward. He wants to ask you a few questions. Open cell one. Goodbye, Phantom. Hmm, that's really odd. The warden doesn't usually ask prisoners questions out of the blue like that. He usually just leaves us to our own devices all the way down here. I'm sure she'll be fine, though. Despite everything, they aren't really barbaric. In fact, they treat us all pretty well. That is, if you cooperate with them. Break time over. Resume scheduled job. Huh, looks like time for doing nothing has ended. Oh, wait. No, it hasn't. Hmm, you're saying that we've met before. Oh, yeah, I ran, I ran to you over the trolley at the hotel. Good times. 
Well, since we've already met before, that means they're we're already friends. Newcomers don't get assigned jobs until they follow day to the following day. We should totes hang out and be oh tots. We should tots totes hang out and be like best friends or something. Yeah, this idea pleases me greatly. You should come meet me by the quarry. It isn't that hard to find. Just go outside and take the entire exit. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Is there... Oh, we have items. We have hidden items in here. Ooh, got an ability capsule, boy. What else do I got in here? Heart scale. I'm sick of planting flowers and fixing up trees. I'm overheard a guard to say that they're running out of jobs for us. Okay. Literally one exit. Gotcha. Is that a Zapdos? No, it looks like your team, maybe. Hmm. Now we're prisoners. Hmm. I am in charge now. I'm so tired of being trapped in the, this hellhole of a prison. Maybe if I go to the Black Stable Fields, I can find a way to escape. Hmm. He's back. I'll do whatever the hell I want. You can't stop me. Initially, the electrical punishment clip. Oh, shit. Yep. I wonder what happens, dude. Hmm. Motherfucking electrocuted, I guess, dog. Hmm. Oh, there's freaking glow the glowing rocks, man. I don't know if our Pokeballs will activate over here. Saka, and that's I lonely a lonely Adam waits for his beautiful friend Valerie to come back from war. She really shouldn't be swimming in the wa that water. It's below freezing. That's not really going to stop Val from swimming. Remember that time Valerie swam in ice water because she was feeling anxious? Oh hey, look, my friend Phantom is finally here. This is my friend Adam. He's a grumpy fellow, but I I guess he's not too terrible. I'm only grumpy because people like Valerie like to do unreasonable things. Seeing Valley, we're waiting for her right now. She decided to go for a swim in freezing water, but we don't talk about her life decisions. There aren't any turrets around the water because no one really expects to swim away from this place. Maybe the statue of being a gym leader is getting to her head. I can say the same to you, Sokka. Yeah, well, you're a gym leader too, Adam. Maybe you got a big head too. So you're just going to paint me as the crazy lady who swims in freezing water. It's was sort of nonsensical, but dear God, I need some way to ease my anxiety. The cold air also helps open up my mind, don't you agree? You won't be thinking it at all because you'll get hypothermia and die. Details, details. Anyway, you're Phantom, right? My name is Valerie, as you know. I haven't seen you around here before, so I guess you only just got here. Yep, they came here with their friends, Lita. She's a little bit of a Whitney Weiner 
a Whitney Weiner, but what can I say? Oh, where is she then? Oh, about that, well, the warden wanted to ask her a few questions. The warden brought a newcomer to his office? That never happens. What can you possibly want with Alita? Obviously, it can't be good. If something bad happens, we can't wreck the place and look for her. That's right. The functionality of our Pokeballs is pretty much non-existent. If we were to um know why that is, one could to the conclusion that the antennas around the castle are to blame. Your subliminalness needs a lot of work, Sako. Why are you telling us this? Just go with it. Fine. Why do you think the antennas are causing Pokeballs not to work properly? Because I've worked on and created Pokeballs in my spare time. Pokeballs work by signals. If you press the button in the circle, the Pokeball will expand. From that point on, you could call out the Pokemon inside the Pokeball. But what were to happen if the signal were to be interrupted by an outside source? The Pokeball wouldn't expand, meaning you couldn't call out your Pokemon. Did you get all that phantom? So why are you saying if we get rid of the antennas, our Pokeballs will begin to function again? So let's look around and find something important. Oh, look at Adam using his big boy brain. What a good boy. This is why I prefer to stay mute. If you two are going to bicker all day, I think I'd like to better if you stayed here. No, 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 I want to go back. Then behave yourself, let's go. So I guess we're about to go shatter some antennas. I'm tired of being here, I just wanna go home, okay. Adam, you just you just gave me the hint, man. We're about to go shatter some freaking. We're about to go. We're about to get free, man. Freedom, you know. Ran up a bit north of here. She was quite excited about the thing. Okay. I'm sick of breaking the stupid rocks. Yep. Where the hell? She ran north. Oh, I guess I could go. Snap, would you look at that? I found a sneaky little antenna back here. This thing thought it could hide from me, but I can smell it from a mile away. I sure did. This is one is really small, though. If anything, it's used to repeat signal. What should we do then? I say we pull this sucker out of the ground and send beside in a little gift. Let's see what we can do. One second, though. Maybe we shouldn't mess with that. I agree with Adam. There's no telling what would happen once you do it. Hmm. See, nothing happened. Oh, shit. <laughs> I said, oh, shit, and didn't even read the damn subtitles. Oh, shit. All right. Pokeball nullification antenna has been dispatched. Security and repair should report to the site immediately. I ain't going back to that jail. Scatter. Tiss, tiss. First day at Black Sea when you're already causing trouble. I think it's time you take you to the warden. Maybe he'll... Okay. Oh, shit, we should have battled right there, dog. Yes, yes, have a seat. I've been waiting for you. So it's been quite some time since we've last seen each other, hmm? Oh, excuse me. How could I be so silly? You probably don't even remember. I was on the SS Oceana when it was capsized. The name I go by around here is Neved. Be sure you remember that. Not even a day in and you're already causing trouble. I'm not surprised, frankly, but I'd appreciate it just a little more if you were slightly more impatient. Important? You were abducted by the Deathwings, weren't you? The Deathwings are extremely high-ranking grunts of Team Exit. We ordered them to kidnap you at a later date, but you happened to walk into Akuma Town at the wrong time. You know what? You're up against them, right? Don't worry. We won't do anything rash as long as you don't, don't in return. I'm sure you're wondering why you're suddenly abducting people left and right. Because of you... Madam X has been extremely on edge. There was just too much interference with our plans. Her first thought was to hunt you down personally, but she decided against it. Make sure to keep Pest locked up. Make sure powerful trainers are contained. If it were up to me, I'd get rid of you right now. If you weren't such an annoyance, all of our plans probably would have been complete as of now. But you know the whole Malia thing. You have no idea what happened at HQ when Madam X found out Malia had died. I've never been been the one to feel fear before that day we lost a lot of good men is that all you can do phantom listen can't you talk if only your friend alita could be as quiet as you are right now maybe she would be in a better spot if she had just behaved herself i wonder if you'd be able to stay away longer than her after being blasted with electricity oh finally i got what it took to get an inch of emotion out of you that's right we gave her a little bit of a shock therapy nothing too major you should leave now phantom you're brought back here by guards. It won't be pretty. Okay. 
I'm going to whoop your motherfucking ass. Okay. All right, guys. We have been kidnapped by some thugs. Team Accent, clearly. So, yeah. But we're going to end the episode here. Um, If you guys enjoyed, please smash the like button. Your support is always greatly appreciated. But with that, I've been the Phantom Michael. I'm going to get the heck out of here, guys. I will see you in the next one.